Last year in Richmond, we had over 472 shots fired. I can be that precise because we utilize an acoustic gun detection system known as ShotSpotter that helps us keep track of this. And we can also tell that many of those shots were fired, they were multiple rounds fired from high capacity magazines. I wanted to share with you a moment what that sounds like because we talk a lot about this, but when you live with it and when you experience what it's like to be in a community that has over the years been ravaged by gun violence, there is a whole different sense of urgency associated with passing this kind of legislation that can save lives and make such a difference to the dynamics of a community. So what I'd like to share with you is what a high capacity magazine can do when it's being fired on a city street, a main thoroughfare, at 11 o'clock at night. And again, this is on a main street surrounded by neighborhoods. And this is what it sounds like at Steege and Cutting in the city of Richmond. I live a mile away from that intersection, so I can tell you firsthand this is a quality of life issue even when someone isn't struck by one of those rounds.